70% of donor hearts go unused every year, meaning people in need never get the life-saving organ. And people who so generously donated never get the chance to have their gift of life recognized upon their death. But with a new device, doctors are breaking through the biggest barriers for heart transplantation. We've seen this scene play out dozens of times in our medical stories. A donor heart on ice being transported in a simple igloo cooler. We typically have about four hours um, to get from the time that we retrieve the organ to implantation in the recipient. Standard hypothermic preservation limits the organ viability. Enter the Transmedics organ care system. In a box and the box uh, has the donor's blood and it perfuses and sort of pumps the heart. The portable box that looks like a Tupperware container instead has high tech capabilities. It's several steps above an igloo cooler in the sense that um, it's really simulating what the body is like. So in terms of temperature, in terms of environment, it's being perfused with blood and not a solution. Um, and so that allows us to really have an extended period of time, over double the amount of time um, that we would have for a typical window to perform the transplant. The heart in the box, as it's nicknamed, can also give doctors a chance to check the organ in action. It's a very fancy, sophisticated um, perfusing system. It's just crazy to see this heart beating in the box and you can assess you know, all of the sort of characteristics that are important that we consider um, before doing the transplant. All of this opens the door for more donor hearts to be considered an option for transplant. Instead of only choosing hearts from people who are brain dead, the new system resuscitates a stopped heart. This heart in a box really overcomes those barriers to allow us to use more organs, you know, save more people, um, and and sort of spread spread that around the country. It's a first for Illinois surgeons at Northwestern Medicine's Bloom Cardiovascular Institute. So excited, so grateful, so honored. Um, it's just wonderful to be part of an amazing team and uh, seeing our patient who, you know, has been waiting for a long time, um, who is really excited to be part of this process. I think just is the icing on the cake. 55-year-old Jerry Dorsey is thrilled to be part of history and thankful for the gift of a heart from the heart. You want that silver lining of, you know, when you pass away, if, if for whatever reason you can provide hope and provide life to another person, we all want to feel useful. It's estimated the heart in a box device will increase the number of hearts available for transplant by 30%. Back to you.